Hello and welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, my name is Tay Chichu, and I don't know what I'm doing, I'll never know what I'm doing, and that's what I'm using as an intro. Welcome to the Scuffed Unboxing, where I unbox a sitting cutie for myself, because I wanted to spoil myself for my birthday month, and a new plush backpack. It's the Bulbasaur one, and I'm very excited to show you guys. And, we, Pokemon, uh, with every order, gave out a two, a two pack of a Lapras inflatable can holder. And then, oh, the coupe de resistance. Tiki just wanted the box. <laughs> it's a lot bigger than I expected. <clears throat> He's so cute. So after that unboxing, I want to see how much we can actually fit into this little guy and see how practical these bags actually are. So I have a couple, I have a box, I have a notebook, my planner, I have a sitting cutie, and I have my wallet. So let's see how much we can fit. This is going to be tough to do one-handed, but if you would it be. Okay. So it seems to be at least a little bit of room. We're going to start off and see, this is my mini Animal Crossing notebook, so let me see if I can get it in there real quick. We were closed, but unfortunately we were unable to get it in. So let's see what else we can fit in it. This is just the smallest notebook I have and I like writing down little notes. So so here's a small little box. Box can fit in there. Wallet can fit in there. Let's see if our new chandelier can fit in there. So I was able to fit chandelier, a box and my wallet but so i feel like this bag has a lot more room than most plush backpacks i mean i only own a few like the gengar plush backpack i feel like it has more room than that like you could fit like a lot of nice little knickknacks in here it's not the best but you know if you're just going on an adventure and just want the bulbasaur aesthetic i get it Today I will be styling this backpack because I just got it and I want to show it off at work. So I'm going to pick out an outfit that will wonderfully go with the backpack. Just doing a tiny little review on the chandelier. I only wanted chandelier because I just started maining him in uh, Pokemon Unite. Um, once Lampent comes back into stock, I'll probably get that as well. Um, very cute, very wiggly. I don't really have a problem with this plush at all. As you can see, these little parts are like kind of like not cheaply made like they don't bother me but you know he looks like he'd be lovely to snuggle with to put on display you know you just kind of set him up you probably have him leaning against something because he clearly cannot really stand on his own but if you just lean him up against something that's how it is with most sitting cuties anyway so yeah my boy i just want to say i think we're serving <laughs> I am absolutely going to be using this backpack, and I'm so excited to. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you've enjoyed, like, subscribe, and check out my other social medias, especially Twitch. I do stream on there, two days a week, at least, right now. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Okay, bye. Bye.